Hey everyone, it's the final round and my name is Jordan. This is a channel where the episodes come out the day before the games are played and the lines are dropped. I'm getting a really big storm here out in Charlotte and I think it's starting to be like the remnants of the hurricane. They're just hitting like every once in a while so I'm going to have the microphone a little bit closer to me so it might be a little bit louder than usual um, but if this is your first time watching the channel, this is a channel where I give data on good matchups for batters. So this is going to be for August 30th. Um, if you're on a player prop app, you can take the player prop for the batter. If you're on a sports book, you can parlay hits if you want to. You can just do single bets. Or if you see a good home run opportunity, you could take that as well. Or just take the guys that you like their numbers. But let's not waste any time and get into the first pick. Now the first pick's gonna be Mookie Betts. Uh, I know he's been on fire and he finally had a game where he didn't get a hit, but uh, I still like him. He's got a really good matchup. Um, so over the past 10 games, he's been hitting 500 with four home runs. Uh, and of course he plays for the Dodgers. Um, he'll, be, he'll be going up against Brandon Fatt. Uh, who gives up a 260 average and a 504 slugging percentage to right-handed batters. And they have a tiny bit of history together. Uh, just two at-bats and one hit, and that one hit was a double. And sticking with the Dodgers, I like Freddie Freeman as my second pick. Um, over the last 10 games, he's hitting 390 with one home run. And against Fat, Fat's a little bit worse against left-handed batters. Um, he gives up a 285 average in a 538 slugging percentage to left-handed batters. And uh, just a tiny bit of history for Freddie Freeman as well. Um, he's got three at-bats and two hits with a single and a double. And if you guys could, could you please like the video? And if you haven't, please subscribe to the channel. And if you have a little bit of extra time, could you leave a comment for the algorithm? You could just say anything, press submit, and it tells YouTube to get that video out there for more people. So thank you for the people who do do that. My third pick's going to be Bryce Harper of the Philadelphia Phillies. Over the last 10 games, he's hitting 444 with four home runs. Um, he's going up against Reed Detmers, who gives up a 305 average and a 558 slugging percentage to left-handed batters, and they don't have any history together. And another Phillies player who's also left-handed that's been doing well um, is Brandon Marsh. Over the last 10 games, he's hitting 467 with two home runs and just like I said, Detmers uh, giving up that 305 average and 558 slugging percentage to left handed batters. Julio Rodriguez, I gotta take him. Over the last 10 games, he's hitting 596, almost 600 average with five home runs. Uh, it's just crazy i know he's not playing tonight uh hopefully it's just one rest day last last time they gave him a rest it was two games so hopefully it doesn't go that long um but he's going up against zach neal who gives up a 333 average and a 646 slugging percentage to right-handed batters so really good opportunity for julio rodriguez and also sticking with the mariners going to be tioscar hernandez uh, who's been hitting 432 with a four home runs over the last 10 games. He'll also be going up against Zach Neal and is a right-handed batter. And before we get into the last pick, uh, I want to shout out one of my partners, Underdog Fantasy. If you haven't tried them out, uh, use promo code FINALROUND11 or the link in the description, and they will match your first deposit up to $100. They are one of the best pick em apps out there. And it's always good to compare lines uh, with other apps. So if you haven't checked them out, I encourage you to do so and just get that free $100 match. And my final pick is going to be Ronald Acuna Jr. of the Atlanta Braves. Over the last 10 games, he's hitting 326 with two home runs. And he is still in Colorado, high altitude, air is thinner, ball goes further. Um, he's going up against Kyle Freeland, who gives up a 312 average in a 546 slugging percentage to right-handed batters. And they have a little bit of history together, nine at-bats and three hits and one of those was a home run for ronald acuna jr so those are my seven picks uh, if you'd like to discuss these lines further i have a discord the link is in the description and uh, you can just hop on in it's free there's a discussion for nfl starting to pick up uh, there's always baseball you know pitcher props 
um, as the lines come out and, uh, you know, WNBA, Korean base, baseball, FIBA, there's all kinds of conversation, uh, eSports, you can just jump on in there and, and people are bringing their own research uh, to go on top of what I do. So, uh, and it's all great people as well. So I don't charge for this information. I'm not giving a few picks and then hiding the rest of them. If I, if you do well with them and you feel like giving back, I have a cash app and a Venmo in the description. You can donate back to the channel and thank you to the people who do donate. And holding this microphone up to up to my face makes me feel like I'm some like radio broadcaster. So I feel like I'm talking a lot differently with it. So <laughs> it's a little bit weird, uh, but yeah, the storm is pretty crazy and loud. So um, prayers for the people in Florida who are going to get hit the worst, and then uh, people in Georgia and on the coast of South Carolina. I'm going to get this edited for everyone. Thank you all for watching. God bless you. It's the final round. My name is Jordan. I will catch you on the next one. Bye.